What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I'm going to talk about some of the changes coming to the Vampire in Update 37. Uh, these are going to be some good changes. For once, I think we're finally getting a little bit of a buff to the Vampire instead of getting it nerfed all the time. Uh, Mist form, this ability, and its morphs are no longer a toggled ability that reduce your damage taken from players or grant crowd control immunity while active. Instead, now uh, you teleport to your position of your cursor up to a maximum of 15 meters away and reduce your damage taken for the next three projectiles by 100% while teleporting. Casting any of these abilities will increase the cost of the ability by 33% for 4 seconds. The base cost is now 4050 per cast but will reduce to 3780 at the max rank of that base ability. Elusive Mist. This morph now grants major expedition and major evasion for 4 seconds after um, reappearing rather than just major expedition and the blood mist morph this morph now causes you to deal damage around you and heal for the damage caused once every two seconds over 20 seconds after activating the ability rather than once every second while active and they also increase the damage per tick by approximately nine percent it seems like Zoss has decided to kind of give the vampire a bit of love in this update uh, as long as this stuff does not change within the next several weeks of the uh, public test server, it seems like we're finally kind of going in the right direction. I've made several videos over the last couple years saying since they kind of redid the Vampire and Werewolf class, it was kind of good to begin with and then it slowly started getting nerfed and things got changed and a lot of people did not like to use a Vampire or a Werewolf. And I think with this update, the Vampire uh, may be a little bit more usable in PvE content. It's always been usable in pvp content but sometimes not as good as it has been in the past but i do think with this update we will see more people finding ways to put a vampire in their build whether they be uh, whether they're doing you know pve or pvp content so leave me a comment let me know what you think about these changes to the vampire and of course if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so and i'll catch you next time peace